Welcome back everyone to another video. How you can use one iCloud on two iPhones. Well, of course, you know that when you go to the uh, main settings of your iPhone at the top, you have your account, right? So that is the Apple ID. You can see Apple account, iCloud and more. So essentially iCloud and Apple ID are connected and it's the same account. So is it possible to use it on more iPhones? Definitely, like if you click on that, you're gonna notice that in my case, when I go in here, I have multiple different iPhones which are assigned in with the very same Apple ID. So it's pretty simple to do it. And that way I'm gonna be able to access all of the same settings, photos, files, everything's gonna be accessible on these iPhones or any new iPhone which I add to this. Although this is possible by obviously just signing in on a new device, if you want to just access the drive, let me show it to you. So we have the iCloud drive in here for files. In case you only want to access that, like, you know, the drive, you would, I would recommend you to do on a different device, which might as well just use a different Apple ID. That's okay. On that one, I would recommend you to open up Safari and literally just look up iCloud.com. And in here, you can log in with your own Apple account or even with someone else's. So in case this, like your account shows up, just sign out and go to a different one. And essentially this way you can access all of the photos, files, the drive in here. So it all works the same way, by, but on a Safari. So you don't have to just mess with anything in here in the settings. You can keep using a different account, whatever, but on Safari, you can always just log in and access any files on any iCloud that you have access to. So hope you found this video helpful. Hit the thumbs up if you did. Subscribe so you don't miss videos like these in the future. And definitely let me know if this is the way that you want to use it. Or if you have some different ideas, go ahead and just let me know about that. It's going to be very useful. So thanks a lot again, and I'll see you in the next video.